In Northeast Ohio, recent statistics show there are two jobs for every person unemployed. So where did all the workers go? To find out, the Fund for Our Economic Future partnered with the Corporate University at Kent State University Stark, Team NEO, Policy Bridge, Connexus NEO, and the Center for Marketing and Opinion Research to conduct surveys, roundtables, and speak with business leaders and workers. We see what they found out in this week's Brain Gain Brief. Brain Gain is sponsored by Farmers National Bank and the Mahoney Valley Manufacturers Coalition. The study, Where Are the Workers?, looks at the workforce in the 11-county area in Northeast Ohio, including Trumbull and Mahoning counties. Fund for Our Economic Future President Bethia Burke says the study found no easy answers, but did unearth some unexpected results. More than 125,000 employees have retired since the pandemic, though the study shows the majority of them are low-income individuals. An eye-opening statistic for employers the study found was that one in five employees is planning to quit their job, while half of those considering quitting say there is something their employer could do to make them stay. In the report, Burke states, quote, So anyone who employs people should look around and say, 20% of these humans that I employ are considering quitting. I should ask them what it will take to make them stay. Burke also says the pandemic has caused a shift in the way people think about work, with 37% saying they believe work is less of a priority since the pandemic. While wages remain a top priority, there are other benefits employees are seeking. 63% of employees say they want to be able to work remotely to some extent. Employees also say they want more meaningful work and flexible hours, with 20% saying they've called off sick due to burnout. Workforce challenges found by the study include lack of transportation, child care, and digital access. Some 556,000 people in northeastern Ohio are without internet access. You can read the full results of the study at wherearetheworkers.com. For more Brain Gain stories, click Brain Gain under the Workforce Development tab at businessjournaldaily.com. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Mike Moliterno. Brain Gain is sponsored by Farmers National Bank and the Mahoney Valley Manufacturers Coalition.